Hi everyone, hope you're having a great day. My name is Marty Donnellan. I'm the director of Joy Community Kitchen, a combination soup kitchen and meat and food pantry serving Gwinnett County. Today I wanted to talk to you about another local ministry, a unique nonprofit bakery called Special Needs and Treats. Their mission is twofold to provide meaningful employment to adults with disabilities and also to donate birthday cakes, cookies, and other baked items to people who could not otherwise afford them. I'm glad they're there because every Friday they donate to us 180 freshly baked wonderful cookies. I think that's like 9,000 cookies a year. What it boils down to is through the month each one of our clients gets one perfect cookie. If you're thinking, oh, one perfect cookie, big deal, you would be wrong. Our clients have a definite love-love relationship with these cookies. One man, a refugee from a war-torn country, gets his cookie each month, has a seat, takes the wrapper off, and slowly munches that thing down to the very last bite, savoring each bite. It's, it's as if for that moment all the stresses and cares of his life are lifted, and it's just him and his cookie. Another client, an elderly lady, tells me that when she gets home, the first thing she does is gobble down her cookie. And what a treat to our, our homeless clients who may be living in cars or tents. The cookies given to us by Special Needs and Treats provide a small but very real comfort to people in a time of need. They are baked by employees with disabilities under the careful supervision of Michael and Tempa Kohler. I'm the parent of an adult child with a developmental disability myself, and I know a little bit about what it takes to create and maintain a work environment in which people with disabilities can succeed. The Kohlers work tirelessly at this, and we are only one of a number of local ministries that the bakery supports. There's simply nothing like it in this area that I know of, and in my opinion, their presence in the community is vital. But they are a nonprofit, and that means even though they have a small retail arm, the bulk of their revenue comes in through donations. The more donations they get, the more people with disabilities they can hire, and the more of our neighbors in need they can help. Well, thanks for listening, and I hope you'll consider making your best gift to Special Needs and Treats today.